Hey everyone, it's Baron from Attack Interactive and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to add or delete products, all the products from one category or how to move products from one category to another. So for this let's go on top of catalog tab and choose manage categories. Alright, so in this page um, I just added men's and women's on their shoes um, category. So in this page we have um, shoes for men's and women. So, what we let's assume we want to um, combine these two subcategories um, and create one category and move all the products that is under men's to this other category, so that we um, have all the products under one category, delete them, or um, change them. So let's just go click on men's and click on category products. If you can remember this page brings all the products that exists under this category. So to make it clear let me go back to my page and go to shoes and choose my men's subcategory which is gonna bring um, our products. Alright, it didn't um, come up, so let me just, um, okay, I know why. This is even good, this happened, so now we're going to fix this problem together. So let's go to manage products. I just added these for the video, so I added them quick, so probably what I did was I didn't choose any um, quan quantity option for this, so that's why it's not showing up let me quickly go to inventory yeah quantity um let's say 10 and we have to choose in stock once again to make it visible so all right we just saved it now this has to this should fix the problem and let's go back to our page and refresh okay so let's go back again and check where we did wrong. So if you could remember, um, we, if you, you can add the product, but it's it's not gonna show up until you choose the right um, options to make it visible. So status has to be enabled. The visibility has to be. You have to choose the visibility. Then you have to go to websites, which we're missing this one in that case. So we have to. Um, make it visible on the website so we have to choose the website and we have to choose the inventory options so we have to do this correct to make the item visible so I'm gonna refresh it and it's gonna show up here um, okay so we have black shoe for man one product under men's and one product under women's so to be able to um, to be able to um, do what we want to do. Let's go back to manage categories and um, go to ca category products. So what we have here is one product and let's assume we have to we're gonna combine so let's just change it into men's and women's and save the category first so here, here do we have men's and women's here so we don't have we don't need this category anymore so what we could do is we could just make it inactive and get rid of this category subcategory but still we have to move our products so we could have had um, tens of products here we just have one now but if it's more it's you're gonna have to do the same so red shoe for women um, what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to go to our original um, category that we want to move the items so this is our little search bar over here whatever we write here it's gonna search so we remember the items name it has woman so we're click we're searching for woman and this is the this is our page so we're gonna have to say no this is not in our category so let me just try to make this more clear let me just start over so we're here under our categories if we were to search under this category so imagine we had 
50 products here if if you want to search within this product list you're gonna have to leave it at yes yes this um, product is under my category and I'm searching under this um, subcategory but here the product we're looking for is not here in our category it's on our product so we're gonna have to choose no and then go for woman again so when we do this it's gonna bring the um, product that is normally under women's and which is inactive now but it just brings it up so we have to click on this and then um, what we're gonna have to do is save category so if we go and do this it's gonna add up at this product to um, the category so right now what we did we um, moved the product at women's to this category let's um and now it's here so if you want to take it out of here you can just click on save same goes with everything now we have no products in women's we uh, moved all the products we had under women's subcategory here um, if you want to remove it again we can just choose it from the action list or let's say uh, let me show you um, if it was yes let's say we search for red right so it searches on over here and it just finds it right away alright I guess this sums it all um, once again it's Baron from attack interactive and thank you for watching this